So there's an easel at Lidl in Hengelo because Nander found out that the charger over at uh, Rheine in Germany is completely powered off or unavailable. So we're still in the Netherlands trying to charge up for free. Oh, oh, oh. Wow, I really like this, uh, this LED strip showing the charging. Four kilometers a minute. And does this, does EV Notify say anything about the charging? I don't think so. Hmm. And this updated to one hour and ten minutes now. And it says it's charging at five kilometers a minute, but that says nothing, of course. Seventy minutes to full. One kilowatt hour after one and a half minute. That's not too bad. And here we have EV Notify showing the charging speed live. So that feels very luxurious. Meanwhile, at 27%, depending on who you ask. So if you think that driving for free is easy, think again, because we got very lucky. The Model 3 just arrived and connected to the AC charger, and over there, the E-Golf is already waiting for us to leave. And yeah, we just started, so we're not leaving yet. Let's see how it's going. After 24 minutes, we charge nearly 20 kilowatt hours. Charging has stopped apparently. That's weird. Why is that? What happened? Model 3 is leaving apparently. It sounds like it's starting again. <coughs> Let's check EV Notify. And we're back. 49 kilowatt charging speed. 40 minutes left. Some statistics. Vehicle charging. 55% it says. But we can see that the BMS is actually reporting 57 already. So this is the second time the charging has stopped. I have no idea why. Nanda pressed the wrong button, so now AC is also trying to start. Let's stop that one. It's connected. Oh, shit. Yeah. No problemo, Nanda, no problemo. So I don't know, this is already the second disconnect. I don't know why. It's probably just... Oh, it's really nice and warm here. Can we see what... Are there some statistics to the machine? Yeah, it oh, it's operated by EV box, I didn't know. <coughs> Let's check how it's going. Okay, we're back in action. I was just checking EV Notify to see the exact charging speed. Which is quite nice. 
and then I saw that it dropped to zero. So, okay, I don't know why the charging seems to stop all the time. And what are they icing? So what I'd like to show you is that even though it's still displaying five kilometers a minute as charging speed, which is obviously not very useful. Um, thanks to EV Notify, we can see that the first throttling is happening because we had 84 kilowatt charging speed before and now it's 45 which is clearly still okay but it's dropping 